What's up guys, this is Zed and this is part 1 of season 6 of the ZM Coetis Creative Club career mode. So, um, I'm not having a 3 parts um, season for this season because uh, I'm, not, I'm not bringing any changes, I'm not making any changes to the squad. I mean, I'm not bringing any players into the squad that we already have because my squad is stacked. I don't think I need to bring anyone in. I mean, the only person I've put on the transfer window is this guy because I really don't see what the fuck he does in our team anymore. I mean, he's 93 and I mean last season i did not like the way he played i remember that i mean it's a while since i've done this particular career mode but i remember a couple of scenarios that I, I i got really pissed and i know it's not it shouldn't be enough for me to sell him at all but i mean i have two i mean i just prefer james i mean he's more og and um even though he's like on the other side and all and well i still i i still would prefer to play him over um Schmidt. This is what the home kit looks like. It's um, Nike. I think it's PSG's kit from like a couple years back. But I mean, it's it's um, white and then it has the middle um, thing. The first match we're going to be playing is going to be this Super Cup match against Juventus. But before we get there, there's going to be a bunch of loan deals and maybe a couple transfer offers that I might receive for a couple of my players. I'm not going to like accept anyone apart from Schmidt. So I just want to do all of that and then I'll get to this match and then I'll be back. So this is the first deal coming for um, Ronnie Schmidt from AS Roma. And they want to give us Ronnie Schlag. I'm not really interested in that. Like Batch has come back from his loan and I would much rather have him than this guy. So I will delegate probably. And I'm just going to go with that. I mean, I doubt that Roma is going to be able to like pull that off, but I mean, let's just hope that they can. So Roma does go for 211, so it means they actually could do that. I mean, I actually asked for 222, but I guess this one will be okay. This will give us a a, a a crazy amount of money for next season, and maybe for even the January transfer window if I decide to buy anyone then. And then we have the offer for Batch. I'm not going to sell him. I'm just going to reject that and i think that is basically it so if they do accept the deal for ronnie schmidt then that would be basically it and we'll just jump to the juventus match straight away so schmidt does get sold and we are ha so schmidt does get sold and we have 171 allocated into our budget so I, I would like to see how much we have now i just want to like sort out all of these other loan offers and shit and then i will jump into the juventus match now we are here at the juventus match and i just accidentally clicked on the press conference thing but i mean let's just look at it and and and, and stuff so you're up against juventus in the UEFA Super Cup. what are you expecting from them I mean, I'm expecting something good from them because I, I feel like the, the last couple of times that we've played them, even though it's not like a lot, they've actually brought their A game and like give me my give me a run for my money. So I think uh, we need to bring a winning mentality for us to be able to defeat them in this coming match. I mean, it's going to be, I'm not going to say it's going to be easy. It's definitely not going to be easy to defeat them, especially on ultimate difficulty. It's been a good preseason for you. I don't know why the fuck they're saying that when... Uh, haven't really done any preseason matches at all, but um, I'm looking for more of the same. I guess I'm just going to say that um, increase more morale, increase the morale of the squad heading into the match. And lastly, it's been a quiet window so far. Are you still planning to bring in any faces before the deadline day? No, I am not. I am actually happy with this group. No one else that I would want to replace any of them, any, any of the players I have. So that's pretty much it for the press conference. And now we are going into the match let's look at the yeah let me look at let me show you guys the thing the kit real quick so this is the away kit okay, we, so we have, we have Cantelo as our um model <laughs> but this this is the away kit Nike I mean I, I switched from Adidas to Nike I think I did that last season or I'm doing that in this season I can't remember I think it's this season yes and this is the away kit basically like the light blue and then the navy blue it fades into the navy blue on the the shorts and then for the alternate kits we have this mess <laughs> i mean i like it a lot i mean it's black gold and i mean it's still it's still the color of the team i mean apart from black though but um the white and the gold are still there and then the logo is just there visible on the black part of the show i mean i really like this kit a lot it might probably be my home kit for maybe one of the coming seasons like maybe one of the coming seasons yes that's how to speak fucking english so uh speak 
the formation and all that let's look at what we have i mean i Cancel is actually dropping he's actually fucking dropping that's that's weird I, I'm, I'm tempted to play this guy stefan but I'm, I'm i'm not going to do that i'm going to play kallenberg though and that's basically the only change i'm going to make it's been long i've played this series this particular career mode and i'm really i really fucking miss um what's his face Helvig and Vardio, I mean, that, that defense is crazy. I mean, those those two guys have done a loss for me in this particular series. And, well, I mean, I, I bet if they don't retire, I mean, if Helvig doesn't retire, it's most likely going to go all the fucking way to the end of the series. But, I, I, mean, I mean, I doubt he's going to last all the way to the end because we have five more seasons to go from, from where we are right now. So, um, Super Cup. Cohetes versus Juventus and where is the where the fuck is the trophy? All right, there it is. Rabio is apparently the captain for Juventus now. That's that's good for him. They have they have Sule, they have um, Alexander Arnold, they have Kamavinga, they have Conor Gallagher, they have Keza. Okay, Vlahovic is still there. All right, so I have a I've, I've taken a good look at their squad. It's playable highlights I'm playing though, so. All right, so they have the first opportunity. They, they're not showing me what the fuck is happening, but I think they have the first opportunity. All right, let's see what Bardio and Helvig have for me in this match. Come on, defensive duties. Come on, Cancelo. All right, Bardio is out of position, but James was able to get there. We, all right, James did a good job. Okay, so, alright, this is a really good opportunity. I see Folding, I see uh, Fonseca. Obviously, giving it to Folding, and I have no idea what the hell happened there. Have no fucking idea what the hell happened there. That is, that was bullshit. That was fucking bullshit. I, I, I even say give it to Folding. But for some reason. Okay, Vardy, what the fuck are you doing? Just clear that. Hey, wait, please. For some reason, I. I don't even know why I said folding. That was supposed to be reset here. Yeah. Reset. Sorry. Ugh. I mean, they keep on giving the wrong fucking person, to be honest. I have no idea why. But I think we have a really good chance on goal here. And, alright, so I think Fonseca is free. And, yeah. There you go. That's the first goal of this entire season. And of course, I mean, who else that for? Take out the highest rated player in the team. He's, <clears throat> I think he peaked last season, and it's just the um, dynamic potential that has got him all, all the way to 93. But that is good for him. So we have. Defensive duties to work on. Nice. Bad mistake from them. And I mean, we didn't really need a lot to win this match. Just one goal. We probably could have gotten three goals if those two counter-attacks that we completely fucking flopped went better than the way it went but I mean we are I, mean, I don't know what they're celebrating is it because like it's a pre-season trophy or something like that but I mean a trophy is only a trophy this is yet another trophy added to our cabinet I have no idea how many trophies I have won I, but I think there's a way to check it so I'm going to check it after after this who the fuck is that standing in the, in the front of the fucking camera in front of the fucking trophy <laughs> that was fucking crazy but anyway, James is the one that's going to be lifting this shit this time. I mean, I've sold Schmidt, so I mean, he's going to be the captain that's going to be on the pitch all the time now. So this is the first trophy that we're winning. It might just be the first trophy of all the trophies that we, have, we could possibly win. The only thing we've not won yet is the Copa del Rey. And I really, really need to win that. So I, I guess I'm going to focus more on those matches like in this in this um season hopefully i can actually do that because i usually do forget shit like this so 4.5 million into the bank i wanted to check what the number of trophies that we have racked up things that will be in office my career trophies we've won three league titles we've won two continental cups i think we've won the champions league twice we have no domestic domestic trophies so um, the Super Cup from last season did not count, as well as the Super Copas that we have won along the along the lines. 
I don't know why, but they're not counted. So I mean, it's five, but I don't know how many of those other preseason trophies that we've won. I have no, I have no idea at all. So, um, yeah, I, I, I guess we're going to start the main season now. Might be tough. I mean, I have no idea what the hell this team is going to pull out of the of the bag. So I actually did bring in a youth academy player. We draw our first match. That's not a good sign. Even though it really doesn't matter, I still want to at least win, win a couple matches. So yeah, I brought in a new, a new youth player. This guy, um, Adeyemi Ali from Nigeria, and yeah, I just want to loan him out. I'm going to reject this offer. No way I'm saying like I already said I'm not saying anybody like I love my team so much I probably could have contributed more against Hitafi, but thanks for playing me yeah whatever work harder and all that shit so I'm swimming to the 25th and let's see if we can get the win against Athletic Club hopefully hopefully we do we don't so that is yet another draw I have no idea why the hell this shit starts like this every single fucking time and I I now have to like work harder in the matches I do play to at least try and catch up and and all that. So it really sucks. Really fucking sucks. So Ali loan agreement. Good for you. Then Zhao Cancelo. I mean he is he is dropping. And he's most likely not going to have a lot of playing time, especially with the fact that I am uh, um, simulating most of the matches but I mean I want him to retire in our team he's probably 33 so he's probably going to retire next season or the season after next season so reject for Tomiyasu uh, Zach Stefan rejects as well Tomiyasu had two all right so you're yeah, not really interested in any of that so I, I think I think I have already done this so I'm I can only hope that they do accept that for his sake because I'm going to sim all the way to the next match that I want to play. So I really hope that they just accept that deal. So, have no, I mean, a, a Champions League match should be somewhere around here. So I'm really going to sim to the 30th. If the Champions League match is an important one, then I would stop and uh, play that. So we, that's a really huge win against Cadiz, 5-1. So I guess that's the start of the season. We have a Manchester United match to play. So I will just sim to this date. And let's hope that we do follow up the 5-1 win with a really good win. Or maybe just a win against Levante. Hopefully, fingers are crossed. Yes, we do. 3-0, that's a relatively big one. So we are now here against the match sorry against manchester united what the fuck was that <laughs> all right so we have the first match in the champions league and that's going to be against manchester united let's look at what team i want to throw out there i guess i guess Rise will start um Kalimberg is not going to start Cancelo is starting because um stewart starts all of the matches that um are simulated so do i want to give anyone a chance no this, this is the Manchester United fucking match. So I'm, I'm playing it. They have Sancho, Malin, Anthony, Ho, Ho, I'm not going to pronounce that. Meyer, Fofana, Mendy, Carmo, Gabriel, Cash, and De Gea. Okay, so I, I don't really, I don't think that I have to worry about anyone in this lineup. I don't think I do. So, I mean, let's... It is offering night. A huge night for both sets of fans. Match day one in the UEFA Champions League. Who will get off to a flying start? We'll have every kick of the ball for you live on EA TV. So I actually completely forgot what my stadium looked like. <laughs> because it's been a long ass time since I have played this Kara mood. But I mean, it's, it looks really good. Camp de Cohetes. It's the new stadium that... I think it's a new stadium from last... I can't remember if this is a new one from for this season or I think it's wait okay yeah I changed it at the start of this season I mean it was off camera but like I did change it at the start of the season so we have a really big match coming up against Manchester United have no idea why it was fucking lagging like that though but yep like the comment just said it's going to be very competitive 
because Manchester United is a team that always gives me bloody fucking headaches and headache number one I don't know why the fuck Rise tried to use his freaking um, right leg to do that but we have a really good chance it's not really it's, just, it's not that good a chance to be honest it's no one no one around the box and all that that was a bad pass All right, what do we have to do defensively? Radio, come on, thank you, as usual. Oh, crap. Okay, this... I don't know what I'm doing, to be honest. I, I don't know if I'm rusty from playing too much player career mode. All right, all right. That is not how I expected this match to go. It's not how I expected it to go at all, so... The guy's name who I cannot pronounce is the one that scores me the first goal. So, um, I mean, come on, you guys. We have to buckle up here. We can possibly come back. We are most likely going to come back. I mean, I don't doubt us coming back. I mean, we're fucking... I mean, that pass was... That pass could have been a lot, a lot better. All right, Vardio, you got this. You don't got this. Come on. Someone, someone, someone has to be... All right, so Vandre just saved our asses there. We have no shot on goal. I mean, we have, I guess, the Fonseca one. All right, Rise, come on, you got this. Make the run. Ah! Come on, guys, come on. What the hell is happening? Right, German, can you turn in? Yes, you can, and thank you so much for that. Thank you so much for that, German. All right, so that is the equalizer, German. And um, I mean, it's just because he was able to get around that defender, and the keeper was never going to be able to catch that shot from, from, from that close at that. So. Let's see if we can get the next goal. Ah, crap. The, the guy was just able to read that. Really well at that. I don't know why my passes are not coming off. I have, I have no idea why the passes are not coming off. I mean, the passes improved. They improved really, really well. I have no idea why all of a sudden... That's like they're mad. But uh, it, was, it was a good first half. I, I'm pretty sure Mario had more possession yet. It was a little tiny bit more possession. A little tiny bit more passes. And I'm not making any changes yet. I mean, I'm, I'm most probably going to bring Foden in for Rise pretty soon. Oh, I might, I might even bring him for, for Florian. For Florian Vitz. All right, so thank God that pass was was fucked. All right, straight to Rise. Back to Rise. Come on, who is there? Fonseca doesn't get to you. All right, no one is trying to help me out right now. Let's give it to. Okay, I think I think I'm, I might just I might just have to cross it. See, all right. Oh, that was sweet. That was a very very sweet volley, but it was low straight at the keeper. Couldn't have gotten anything from that, but we po possibly. I mean, we're on the we're on the upper for right now. If I'm all, if I'm not wrong. Alright, Helvig at it again. Let's see, can he get this to Foden? Who gets to Fonteca? And that was, that was nice. That was nice. That was a well worked goal. Alright, that was Korean or Foden, I think. 
I mean, Helvig, Helvig completely turned that around just now. And that was a really nice passing header. A, a heading pass, a headed pass, whatever. Passing header, headed, heading pass, whatever. But I mean, all in all, we, we are at the front foot now. 82 minutes, I doubt that they are going to be able to come back. I mean, it's, I mean, there's time. There's enough time for a comeback, but I'm going to try and bury every single opportunity for that. All right, so that is the end of the match. We have won it. 2-1. And that is that is a very good win to begin our European campaign. <laughs> That's actually what the, the competitor said, and I'm repeating it. But, yeah, it was a really good win really good win I'm th thank god for helping thank god for helping that that was i mean that that goal that goal was insane i mean it, w it was the fact i mean the pass was really high i was thinking that the, the the keeper was going to do something about that but he did not and korea was able to get that straight back to into the path of of um Fontega, who was not with his 99 finishing going to look to miss that from there never ever there is sevilla there is real society i think the next one i would want to play all right, so the last person, no, I'll, I'll play this one. I don't know where the um the Copa del Rey is. I don't even I, I don't even know if it starts in this half of the season. So we just drew two matches in a row. That is not good. It's not good at all. Let's right, so hope we win against Sevilla. Okay, we do win that. Then the one against Victoria Pilsen. I don't know. If, I don't know if that's how you pronounce it, though. But that is a really good four 0 win. Then we have Granada away from home. That's yet another win, three 0 And now we have um, Almeria coming up next. We should be able to win this. Come on, come on. Uh, we do not. And what we are here in this match against um, Leverkusen, if I'm not wrong. What messages do I have? None really. So. I'm 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 doing the playable highlights for this. Yeah, I'm doing the playable highlights for this. And am I really supposed to do anything? No, I'm not. So we have both won our first two matches. So all right. So let me bring Callum again because Florian Vert isn't at full health. Then I I think I think I will play Tomiyasu here and uh huh. I, I think i'm good with this yeah i'm i'm good with this so playable highlights let's see what we can do against by leverkusen we are here in their stadium i have no idea what the fuck it's called it's called the buy arena yeah the buy arena all right so this we should be able to like get the win here if i'm not wrong I mean, we should try our best to get the win. We should have more attacking options than that, if I'm not wrong. And exactly, we do. So, I see, I see, um, what's his face? German and, well, that, that pass got completely fucked up. But we're still in the sixth minute. They have a, a counter-attack of their own. I probably could have done, like, a through lob for us to be able to, uh, make the most after that counter-attack. We weren't able to, though. And I just let I let you just let them lose. All right, come on, defensive duties, guys. All right, thank God they they blocked that. All right, so solo run for Fonseca. I have no idea if the game has set this up for failure already, but no. Power shots, please. Thank you. So that is the first goal. No long way for the opener, and. All right, so we have a crossing opportunity. I don't know why there's such a gap between the defenders and and Kalimberg. That's very, very fucking weird. Can Foden get there? No, he cannot. Can we get there? Yes, we can. No, we cannot. I mean, I, I probably could have um, passed in the in a better direction there. I don't know why I did not. All right, so let's try and hold. No, all right. So thank God that was high and wide, high and wide. <laughs> all right, from Foding to German, that could have pos probably been a lot better than that. Anyway, so we have a solo run for Foding here, 
and I think German is our helper right now. So please score this. Thank you. I mean that was that was very risky what I did there. <laughs> that was very very fucking risky. Uh, I mean the keeper like most likely like six out of ten would have gotten that, but then the luck was on our side. We are winning the the third match in a row for the Champions League. That is good. So we are yet to lose. If I'm not wrong, we are actually yet to lose a match. I'm not sure, but I'm going to check it out in a bit. So we have goals from Fonteca and German. We probably could have gotten more, but I mean, I'm content with what I have here. So, I mean, let's look at the calendar to see if we have actually lost any match. I doubt we have, though. But before I do that, so let me look at the standings. I am third. Yeah, I haven't lost a match in the La Liga. Espanol is second with 18 points. That's good for them. Yeah, I... I've been drawing matches like crazy. That's that's the problem right now. So I haven't lost any match anywhere at all. I don't see any red at all. That's that's good, I guess. Next match, I mean, I I would what I would not play this one. So we draw yet another match against um Alaves, and that's our first loss against Real Valladolid. Very fucking stupid. And please don't tell me those were cup matches. Don't tell me okay, none of them were cup matches. All right, so that's our first loss against Valladolid there. Don't know why the fuck that shit happened, but um, we have Bayer Leverkusen up next. Um, nothing at all. I, I, I think Fonseca just peaked. If I'm not wrong, chill. Sorry about that. But yeah, yeah, yeah. He just he just peaked. So. I'm, I'm going to put this on balanced. I mean, those stats were fucking crazy, man. <laughs> Chill. I want to look at that. Just give me one second. Like, he has 99 finishing, 99 attacking position, 99 shot power, 93 long shots, 88 penalties. That is, that is insane. <laughs> That's fucking insane, to be honest. But, uh, alright, so let's focus on what we have right now, which is the return fixture for the match against... Leverkusen. I'm not going to play this one. It's going to be a simulated. It's going to be a simulation, and I'm pretty sure we should win it. So, yeah, four-one win. Fonteca, Allegra, Florian Verts, and Phil Foden get the wins for us here. Next up, we have a match against Atletico Madrid, who are first in the table. If I'm not wrong, we have dropped all the way down to six because of that loss. Really wish I did not fucking lose that match, but we are in 19 points. Wow. Because we drew, we drew, we lost and we drew three, if I'm not wrong. Or we drew two, rather. So they are 14 points ahead of us. That is crazy. They are, they are winning like mad. I think we, we might just be the team to, um, to shit on their parade. <laughs> to rain on their parade, rather. I didn't make any changes to the starting lineup. I just wanted to go in, fuck him up, go out. So, um, playable highlights. At the, at, the, at the Wanda Metropolitano, this this might be tough. This might be easy going. I feel like I feel like we should have. Let's try something really fucking crazy here. Would this work? I have no idea if this will work or not. But I think I think we can get this to the. All right. So for some reason I cannot I, I cannot I cannot do anything with that. For some reason I have that that's fucking stupid. That's fucking stupid. Alright, so far post. Why the hell could I not do anything? Vardio, what do you have? Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> that was not a very good not a very very good volley from him. I mean I'm not really expecting him to have any good volleys at that, but what why was that that was overrun. That that was overrun and it was very, very pointless. Alright, so we have German. We have Fonseca. Don't know why it went to freaking Foden, but all right. So let's try and defend this. I mean, we. I I cannot draw yet another match. Come on, come on, guys. I cannot draw yet another fucking match. That's going to be. That, that's just going to be so sad. So whoops, that was that was that was a really bad mistake. But Helvig to the rescue, not to the rescue anymore. Please give it to the keeper, whoever that is. Alright, so. Ugh, come on, come on. 
I mean, I had three in a row. I don't know why I'm complaining, but I, I, I want. All right, all right. Come on, we got this. Monteka, you got this. I, I, I honestly don't know if you got this or not. Can you get this to German? No, you cannot. Just to have a chance. We still have a. What the What the hell happened there just now? What the actual fuck happened there just now? All right, this is not a very good start to the season. I mean, we had a bunch of interesting uh, opportunities, and that that was that was fucking crucial for Helvig from Helvig, but. Uh, we lose the match. This is the second time I'm losing to Alex Madrid. We won every other one. I mean, that's why I'm losing to console myself right now. Ah, <laughs> oh, fuck. Don't know how the fuck we did not make anything from this match. Probably could have that one take a solo run. I don't know why. I mean, I fucking panicked. I probably could have just held the ball with him. And shit, I waited for either German or Foden to make make a good run for it. But I did not do that. And uh we lost the fucking match. So um I think the, the, the last match I would play, the next match I would play is going to be this one against Liverpool. Sorry, um what they call them. What's their fucking name? Real Madrid, yes. Sorry <laughs> about that. Um But I'm going to simulate to the Barcelona match. I'm going to play that one. The table highlights of this team. Alright, we're home. And uh, we should have the upper hand in that match. I think. We should. We should. I mean, there's no reason why we should not. Let's just change this real quick. Alright, I'm supposed to use the home fucking kit. The home kit, sorry. <laughs> I don't know why I swear so much. Um, Rise, obviously. I don't think Bart has played. Yet, yeah, I don't think he has played. So, I will give um, Kalenberg this chance. And I'll, you know, I think I'm okay with that. I am okay with that. So, um, Fonteca is already only 94, that's good for him. Um, Cantelo has dropped down to an 86, that's not good for him. We're back at the camp, the Cohetes. And we're, 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 we're going to begin the Barcelona. This is the second huge team that are playing. I, I haven't played against Villarreal this, this this season, have I? I mean, majority of the really good teams just died down. Or rather, sorry, what am I saying? They're at the bottom. Or at the, they're... Whoa! What did I just do? What did I just do? Okay, that was... I, I got completely... I don't know what the fuck I did there just now. <laughs> Alright, so... What, what do I do here? Just a tap. Good one. So that's a goal in the 42nd minute for Fonseca. Panenka, embarrassed keeper. <laughs> Alright, so what do we have now? We have a crossing opportunity. Let's hope the game doesn't fuck, fuck this up. Please let me able to pass. Thank you. Don't know what the hell I did. I don't know what the hell I fucking did there. But we possibly might just be able to win this easily. Let's hope that we are able to. No, my fucking god, my fucking god, that was, that was, that, that was a crazy ass goal. That was a fucking crazy ass goal. But I, I, I want to not lose this match or draw it. I want to fucking win it. Just has hasn't been the best of starts. I mean, we can still we can still come back and win the fucking. La Liga from, from from this bad start. But it's not it's not very likely though. It's, it's not very likely. Alright, so we have one more chance. I don't know who is making a run for it, but I'm guessing German will be the best option. Fonseca, come on. Come on. Alright, that's good. So That was me being too cocky. That was me being too fucking cocky. I mean, normally he would score shit like that, but I guess, I guess it's just not this. This episode is just not my episode. 
<laughs> same with last, same with yesterday's episode for Kaito No God. I mean, if you guys don't watch that, you should definitely go and watch it. I mean, it's really fun. I would say. I mean, I've never done a play a player car app for that long before, and I'm actually really enjoying it. So next up, we have Champions League match against Manchester United. Obviously, doing playable highlights again, and uh, I'm going to skip the press conference. Am I going to make any changes? Probably, probably. But I just want to use the alternate kits first. So, team management. I'll bring in Rise. Should I bring in Rise? Yeah, I'll bring in Rise, and then I'll bring in Hallenberg. Then I'll bring in Stewart. All right, I, I guess I'm good. I'm good for now. So I mean, we should be able to win this match. Hopefully, I mean, we won the first one. Oh fuck! 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 I really wish. I really wish. Um, we were doing a lot better this season. To be honest, I, I don't know. Maybe it's because I'm rusty and all. Because normally I'm usually like bowling on this on this particular series. I mean, the team is really fucking good, and I'm not supposed to be. I mean, I'm not supposed to be doing as bad as I'm doing. I mean, I really, I really wouldn't say I'm doing bad. I'm just making a lot of bad options. I mean, in the, I mean, in the, in the, in the match I played, the full match I played against Manchester United, I did really well. In the second half, more than the first half, but I mean, I did really well nonetheless. So, all right. So, who is that started? Tammy Abraham. Okay. So, Marlon is not playing this time. They have the first opportunity. So we've won, we've won all four matches in a row. So I, I would like to, I would like to not lose that record. So we have a slow run for Rissi. This is going to be a walk in the park, to be honest. Not going to catch him, no matter who the fuck you are. You are, unless the game fucks you up, obviously. Which it has fucked me. And, well, Fonteca is the one that is going to get the goal there. I mean, I honestly thought we were going to be Rissi. But I mean, the game slowed it down, and well, I mean, he got the assist instead. So now we have to defend their own counter attack. I don't see, I don't see them making any crucial passes here. Yeah, obviously, Helvig was just going to shut it down immediately. So solo run for Fonseca. I want that did not just happen. That did not just fucking happen. That that did not just fucking happen. <laughs> what the hell was that? What the actual fuck was that? I mean, I can't, I can't, I can't even remember what happened just now, <laughs> to be honest. But all right, let's see what I can do here. Back to Pedri, who's there? What the fuck was that? How, why would you even jump early there? All right, we can start again. To so Helvig and. Man, what the fuck was that? Alright, so we have a counter-attack in the fifth minute. This will be the last the last um, opportunity for a goal. And teammates around him. Have no idea why the fuck I did that, but I mean Alright, so we have one more chance. Yeah. I'm not doing really well this episode, am I? I'm really not. I, mean, I can only that was that was a mistake i can only hope that uh all right so uh, that's that's the win i guess yeah so i mean I, I would say that i would definitely i could definitely have done better in this match but just like the other matches that i have played i'm not really making the best the best of all the the the, the options and stuff all right next up we have valencia then we have real madrid this is the one i'm going to play the full batch of so let's hope that we do win no, we didn't. We draw yet another fucking match. What the hell? We where the hell is the Villarreal match? Are we not going to play Villarreal this this first half of the season? Oh look, we actually. Oh no, that's not Villarreal. That's Levante. Villarreal. We actually haven't played them. That's weird. Yeah, the 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 match is in January. I think that's supposed to be the match, but whatever. All right, so we are. Um, let's see what we have here. Nothing important. Thankfully, he's can keep a few on the ground. Um, all right, so we have lost 
a couple of times to, to Madrid. We have also won them a couple of times. So let's hope that this is going to be a win, not a loss. So Alright, let's look at the formation real quick. Obviously I'm going to play Rise. Oh, no, I'm 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 going to play Foden. I'm going to play Rise on this on this wing. I mean he's left footed, so I mean, this is going to be the first time in a long time that German is not going to be starting a match. I'm not going to play Kallenberg either. I mean, I'm, I'm going to bring it on the second half. Is there anyone I want to play? Yes, Stuart. Yes, Cantelo is dropping and I'm not really that much inclined to play him anymore. So it's it's snowing. So I think I do not want to wear the, the um, this kit. So I'm going to wear this. Right? Now, this will be better, which means I'm going to have to give Madrid this one. Alright, so... Wish me luck. Alright, so ZM Cohetes versus Madrid. This is going to be the last full match for this episode. If you guys have enjoyed it so far, make sure to hit that like button. And also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And let's hope that we are able to get a really good win. We have Marcus Edwards here. That's really interesting. Marcus Edwards. They have um, Marcus Keane. They have Vinicius. It's going to be a really tough attack. I have no idea what this guy's rating is, Marcus Edwards, but I, I feel like it's just going to be it's going to be really good. He's playing on the right, so I mean that's one person that we should definitely look out for. Uh, okay, the 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 away kids, sorry, the alternate kids, not really doing that much. So I mean, I'm going to have to be extra careful on this turf, and just like that, I almost give the ball away. No, why did why why did you wait? He actually got that ball. Oh no, it was the defender that played it. Right, Vinicius is going to be a very dangerous. Okay, give it to Rise. What can I do here? Power shot, please. Thank you for that. And that is the first goal in the six minutes for Rise. It's been long that I've scored with him. And that was... Shot power, 120.1 miles per hour. Was that miles per hour or kilometers per hour? I, I don't know, but... It was... It was a really good opportunity I sought out, and I was able to bury that in the back of the net. Come on, I mean, you were still with the ball, so like... Just play the fucking advantage, man. No, that's a fucking mistake. Oh my god. Um, and that's just another fucking mistake. That was completely my fault. That was me just being really fucking stupid at the back just now. Alright, so. Come on, we got this. We got this. Don't let that get you guys down. Keep the momentum on your side, guys. Keep it on your side. So let's just go and attack. Alright, I mean, they, they, they want to kill my fucking players for some reason. For some reason, they want to kill my fucking players, and that's just going to be offside. Alright. Alright. Huh. Okay, so, when we go again, we go again. Thank you. Alright. I didn't see what to do there, so I just let him... Come on, come on. Come on, guys. Come on. Okay, what does James have? Nothing. Hits the wall. Or that hits the... Thank you for that. Okay, Fonseca is still with the ball. Right back to. Can we do something? No, we cannot. Okay, that was. Oh, that was that would have been so that would have been so good, but it did not come off. So we just have to make sure Venetia does not get loose there. All right, that's good. Thank you for that, Zaracho, and. Come on, that's not who the fuck I passed to. I mean, I feel like this match would be so much easier if um, it wasn't snowing. 
because I cannot see shit. Like legit, I'm 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 not even trying to like make excuses at all. Like I legit cannot see what the fuck I'm doing. Oh my god! All right, so that's I just got saved right there. I just got fucking saved right there. All right, so um, any changes I want to make? Um, I think I think I want to bring in German. I miss him, to be honest. <laughs> I fucking miss him. So I'm, I'm, I'm going to bring him in, and then uh, no one else, really. That's just German. And let's see what we can do for the second half. I honestly cannot see. I, I legit, like, honestly cannot see that much right now. Alright, please. Thank you. Thank you so much for that. I mean, he just he just got into the match, and that is what he's doing. That is one really good thing I, I, I like about this guy. He's scoring. He scores really really good goals. He's fast enough to get around the defense like that and set himself up for the outer foot finish. All right, so we have the outer, the the, the strong. What the fuck is that that thing called? We have the stronger foot. We have taken the stronger foot. We have taken the lead. Whatever. <laughs> All right, they gave it away, and that was that was very dangerous. And come on, come on! Oh my God, you actually you actually injured him. That's Zarate. That's Zarate, right? Crap! That was just a very fucking disgusting tackle, to be honest. That was fucking disgusting. I'm bringing Cancelo over to Miyasu. Uh, I think Halemir will come in for. Sorry, I think I'll have been coming for Brits, and then it's long that Bash has played, so Bash will come in for, for James. Alright, so. Who was it, the ball? I, I don't know if I was in the ball or not. I don't know if I could have just like, passed to a player. Alright. Can we get something out of this? No, they were just able to save that. Lucky them, to be honest. I mean, if Kallenberg got that, that, was, that would have just been the end. That would have been the fucking end. And please do not confuse me, guys. Do not... What the fuck are you guys doing? Alright, so that is good. Alright, so that is the third goal of this match. Second for German, and he's coming on as a sub, so that's good for him. Nice sweat from um, Fonteca. I, mean, I, I don't know how well Fonteca has done in this season. I mean, he's supposed to have done really well with the, um, in the simulation because, I mean, he is a beast. That's the only, that's the only way I can... I can... Uh, No, no, come on, come on, stop giving me passes that I did not fucking ask for. That's like fucking bullshit. Alright, no card, right? Thank you. Oh, he actually did get a card, what the fuck? I, mean, I don't know how long they can do whatever it is they're doing. But, alright, so we have, we have the ball now. Okay, so I mean, this is a chance for German's hat trick. Thank you. That is his hat trick. So I mean, lucky him, All right? Or like, good for him, rather. He's not lucky. I mean, he's actually working it very well. And that is the fourth goal, third goal for German, and it is. And he's coming on at his sub. He came in, in the second half and he has scored three fucking goals. All from that same angle. <laughs> Funny enough, all from that same fucking angle, man. Okay, no, okay, okay. The, the second one was the sweat, actually. I, I completely forgot about that. It was the reset goal that was from that angle. So. Alright, so that's the end of the match. That is the end of. Okay, that's not the end of the episode. But that's the end of the match. Alright, so that is. That was a very good performance from him. I mean, I, I, I cannot just.
help but feel that I would have, I, I can do so much better. Or the team can do so much better in the simulation. I don't know why the hell they're drawing so much. It's it's fucking crazy how, how much they are drawing, actually, to be honest. It's really, really fucking weird. But, I mean, that is the case. Nothing I can really, nothing I can do about it, actually. All right, that was a good win against Real Madrid to end our winless run. That's that's the first time I've had that. <laughs> that, 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 that. That was fucking crazy. So, I'm just going to simulate to this Espanol match. I'm, I, I do not want to... Oh wait, I think I think the Ballon d'Or should be anytime soon if I'm not wrong. So, so let me see if I could if I can uh, catch a thing in the news. Breaking news, blah blah blah. Creative now regard, blah blah blah. We might be take on creatives. Okay, so they haven't said who has won it yet. But okay, so we have this match against this team. I'm just going to simulate it. Fix problem and save the change, right? So this is going to be a pain in the fucking ass. But Tommy Asu, obviously. And then... We have just two players. That is crazy. That is fucking crazy. <laughs> we have just two players. We literally loaned out our entire squad. We loaned out our entire reserves. To be honest, that's, that's fucked up. Alright, so we win it. Tommy Asu, Foden, Fonseca and Foden. Foden, Foden gets a brace. That's interesting. I actually would like to see how many goals they have all scored this season though. I mean, we're scoring goals, it's just that we're not winning matches. We've won only 5 out of 16. That is insane. We are drawing like mad. That is one of the things that annoy me like fucking crazy. I mean, it's... We are... We are like 12 points. We're 12 points. Is that 12? 11 points. And we're 12 points away from Atletico Madrid. We're still 12 points away from them. I feel like I feel like we can we can do so much better than what we we are currently doing right now. I mean, I'm just not going to um. I'm just not going to simulate the. Uh, I'm just not going to like simulate from the calendar. I'm going to simulate from the like the actual simulator itself. All right, now I'm just looking for the Ballon d'Or thing. I have no idea when the fuck they are going to announce it. It's supposed to be on the either the eighth or the tenth. We're currently on the tenth. But let's sim to the twelfth to see if anything is going to be. Alright, I still can't find it. Still can't fucking find it. I mean I'm I'm really hoping that um Fonteca does get it. I can't remember how many goals he scored last season to be honest. Like that thing is just completely out of my fuck Oh, I just saw it. I just fucking saw it. I just fucking saw it. How the hell did I not see it? It was Fonteca. Fonteca won it again. I just knew it. How the fuck did I not see this? That's crazy. <laughs> That's fucking crazy. I'm really, I'm really happy that I did see this. But fact is that Zaracho has been injured for two months. That's not that much. I mean, we're going to have him back in like February or something. So, I mean, it's good that we have a squad depth because I'm not really going to miss him that much. I'm going to miss him because he's like the best player in that position. But... Um, I'm, I'm good, yeah. So, we're going to simulate this one and let's hope that we get the win. Foden versus Fonseca and Foden again. Foden gets another brace. That is, that's really good for him, to be honest. I'm really happy that he's scoring goals. Not when I play, though, but like <laughs> through the Sims. Uh, Alright, so the last match is going to be against uh, Sota Vigo. I don't know what changes I want to make for this match. Um, I mean, um, Stefan hasn't played at all this season, so I guess he's going to play, play here. I'm going to put Stewart in for Cancelo. We're going to give. Uh, kind of make a chance, give Risa a chance here, and all right, so let's simulate. We should be able to win this, hopefully. No, we don't. We draw yet another fucking match. How big is one that gets the goal? I don't know what the fuck the strikers are fucking doing in this match. Oh, god, that's so irritating. All right, so we end the season, end the end the half of the season at sixth position. All right, so maybe a champion league position might be good. Atletico Madrid has actually dropped off. They lost their match and Barcelona has taken pole position, even though they're still the same amount of fucking goals. We are nine points behind them, so I mean, I can still catch them. I can actually still catch them. I can actually still make a fucking difference. If these guys can actually still make a fucking difference, please, Jesus fucking Christ. I might have to bring in a player next episode. Uh, I'm, I'm not sure who, but I might have. To, I, I might just have to do that. Um, Takahiro Tomiyasu. 
how do you fuck down to see this though? Alright, so I'm going to increase this to 120. And then to 200. Let's see. Alright, so they go for 120. Please pause. Alright, I'm, I'm going to try and sort that out later on. As for you, one year. Alright, so I guess I'm good. So this is the end of the episode. All I want to see now is the goals that they have scored. So, I mean, I was here just now. Why the fuck didn't just check it? Alright, so Fortega has 20 goals, 9 assists. The assist leader of the league as well. That's interesting. Uh, German is next, 10 goals, 4 assists. Foden has 8 goals, 2 assists. Risi has 5 goals, 3 assists. And the five, the, the fifth the fifth player is Reece, sorry, Calvin James with 2 goals and 1 assist. Uh, Florian Wirtz has more assists than Calvin James does. So I guess he's going to be like the fifth if you actually... Um, put it like that on goal, on goal contributions and all that but that's not really important so um this is the end of the episode i wanted to check something just now i really can't remember uh fuck it's, it's completely stick my mind but anyways whatever whatever uh thank you guys for watching if you guys have enjoyed the video make sure to hit that like button and also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already let me know what you think about the matches let me know if what, who you think i should bring in the next episode i mean i'm thinking of vlahovic or haaland I mean, you might, you might want to ask me why, because <laughs> I mean, we have probably Fonteca here. I mean, I probably might not. It's just because I, I feel like I feel like we're drawing a lot of matches because maybe the team might be the same and the teams already know how to counter us. I feel like that might be the issue. Not sure. I doubt that's the issue. I'm, I mean, I'm, I'm, I doubt FIFA should be that intelligent at all. <laughs> so, whatever, whatever. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Look at this moment in place, see that I'm open to taste You could have gone but a fake, a loving the words that he says See when I'm up in your place, too many up in your place Too many faces, too many places, yeah